Welcome, I'm from Amisa Samsung Galaxy A14 and today I'll show you how you can put this phone into safe mode. So to get started, pull down your notifications and extend the list. Once you see your power button right here, I'm gonna click on it and then press once on the power button and then or power off option and then hold it. As you can see, it changes after a moment into safe mode. I'm gonna simply click on it once, and this will initiate a reboot of the device and boot you into safe mode. Now, while the device is booting up, I'm gonna quickly mention that safe mode is typically used for troubleshooting your device. So, if you have some kind of problem, maybe some app is causing you problems and you can't get rid of the app or whatever, then hopefully you can boot the device into safe mode, and from there you should have no problem resolving the well, that problem because whatever app would be causing you problems can no longer run in safe mode. Only the pre-installed applications like uh, browsers, message, messages and stuff like that, all the default apps will work and any other application that you have installed yourself and even some of the ones that actually come with the device pre-installed will be disabled from running in this mode. And hopefully I will have a couple visible so I can show this. As you can see, there's also a watermark right here, safe mode, just so you know that you are in this mode. Okay, so we have couple. Number one, widgets don't work. And coincidentally, actually, the uh, Samsung browser is one of those apps that does not work in this mode. And you can see it based on the fact that it now became a monochrome application. Here we also have a bunch of Google apps that don't work, which is also surprising. So if Google TV, Photos even, uh, Drive, YouTube Music, uh, Google Meet. Then we have a couple additional apps right, right here, like Spotify, Disney Plus, uh, I think Clock. Not sure why it's uh, in Cyrillic, but whatever. And it looks like all the, oh no, there's more. Uh, so here we have a couple Microsoft applications that also won't work. So there we go, those are all the apps that don't work by default. These are all default applications. None of them have been like installed additionally. So all of these will not work. And obviously anything else that you have installed yourself will obviously not work. Now, if you try to open up one of these apps, it gives you this pop-up, downloaded apps, disabled and safe mode. So obviously it, it can't run. Now, once you're done with this mode, you resolved your problem. You can go back to normal one by simply finding your power button once again, and then selecting restart. Once the device boots up, it automatically boots up into normal mode. So with this being said, if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.